So in the app, if you click on, um, you know, if you're on timeline, which is the bottom left button timeline, and then you hit this little plus in the bottom right, this lets you add different things. So I want to show you a couple things here. So if I click here in the middle where it says event, I've got two different, I've got three different options, but if I click on event, it gives me these. These are my recent events at the top. These are ones that I've used a lot, so it just puts them up there. But you have all these choices for, if you just go on a walk, if you can look down here towards the bottom, you'll see walk. Meditation is also down there, sitting in the sun, um, hot shower, sauna. So you have all these choices in the <clears throat> event section. In the, if you click event again and go to activity, then you have all of these different things to choose from. Aerobics, CrossFit, general exercise, <clears throat> gardening, guided breathing, um, Pilates. So any of these that you choose, it'll end up putting up here in your recent activity so, that's easy, so you don't have to scroll through everything later and, and find them. Um, so they'll be up there. So you can, my point here is that you can get specific with your activity, with your, with your exercise, and you'll put it in there accordingly. So um, if I did some weightlifting this morning, I could just click weightlifting. It'll ask me for the date, the time, and the duration, and then it'll plug it, plug it in there. Okay, I hope that's helpful.